So it's the season of root vegetables, hoodies, braising, all that good stuff. So we thought that we'd dress today uh, roasted squash and potato salad. Um, this is really simple, but you could dress it up with chevra, walnuts, apples, whatever you really like in season. We're just doing something very basic to demonstrate the sauce that we're making. So we just treated these potatoes and squash by roasting them with a bit of salt and oil. So a little trick, if you don't want your bowl rolling around on you, is to take a long kitchen rake, moisten it a little bit, and you do this. This is what we do um, in the chef world when you can't get a friend to help you out. Or if you're just a bachelor like me and you're always cooking alone for one. Some of the gastrique goes in a bowl. Maybe we'll use this much for the base of our vinaigrette. Now, because of the consistency of this gastrique, it's actually going to um, help emulsify the vinaigrette. We're going to add salt now because salt doesn't melt in oil. Salt only melts in water. So we're going to add a good pinch because we want the sauce to be quite strong. And then our oil. We're going to use lemon juice and white wine vinegar to flavor this, but we're not going to add it till the end. And that's just going to be to taste. And you can see how this is getting um, opaque, almost white, and that's a good sign, and it's getting thick. So this was an old school trick that an old German chef taught me how to make a vinaigrette. And he taught me in the corner, and he wouldn't teach any of the other cooks in the kitchen because he didn't like them. Um, I use it less now with modern hydrocolloids and thickeners like xanthan gum, but it's still a great technique and a great way to punch something out. See this nice thick consistency? Now to flavor it. I just use my hand like this to make sure if there's any seeds that they don't fall into whatever it is I'm flavoring. In professional kitchens, we always use tasting spoons, but I have 10 tasting spoons in total built into my arm. It's good. This is white wine vinegar. Double acidity using both citric and acetic acid is a trick to kind of make the palate sense sweetness. So you're actually going to increase the amount of acidity so it's going to bring out more and more flavor and make something really pop, but your palate doesn't recognize it as being too acidic. So sometimes three or four different types of acid will be in one dish. So I'm just adding these vinegars and lemon juices to taste. So you can add more or less depending on what you're doing. If this was a vinaigrette for something uh, less sweet, we might not want as much acid. These are going to be quite sweet, these root vegetables in season. So we have quite a bit of acid in here to balance it out. That is good too. And then to finish it up, a little bit of walnut oil. And again, this is just for flavor. And we can make a beautiful salad with walnuts and chavra on this dish. Oh, and these are just some curled green onions because we love green onions and potatoes. But really, this could be any sort of stuff that you like. So this is one of many ways you can use a gastrique. In this case, an autumn gastrique with a nice roast root vegetable salad. But feel free to experiment and add it to everything.